So I'm actually trying out the ODG uh, smart glasses, and I see a movie. I mean, I see the real world around me, and I see an overlay of a, of a movie. It's about, I'm estimating, I'm just estimating, I don't know if it's the actual spec, but it's about like a 45 degree angle. It looks, looks good to me. Uh, and it's a, a stereoscopic 3D movie as well, so that's very effective. Yeah. Absolutely. Now, something to be aware of is that the lenses have been customized for me. So before I was putting these glasses on, they actually put custom lenses uh, to reflect, because I normally wear glasses. So, uh, oh yeah, look at that. Like, I'm actually watching bubbles and things flying out towards me. Very, very impressive. Do you see the camera feed? Yeah. Now go ahead and, well, oh, okay. look at this. Do you see a building pop up? Uh, yeah. Now go ahead and manipulate it. Like, go ahead and rotate it. Yeah. Oh, okay. It tracks on the marker. So, so they over, we got, okay. So they overheard me saying that I wasn't experiencing p tracking. So they, they did want some one-upmanship with me and they, they gave me this sheet. And, uh, oh, they're giving me another sheet. So what happens is when I have this sheet in front of my eyes, uh, I see augmented objects on top of it. So I'm gonna look at it. And yeah, so I, I see a, like an enhanced map as I look down. So there is, you know, there is some latency. It's to be expected because it's a very, you know, complex thing going on. But even so, you know, very, very impressive. So we actually have a formal interview with ODG, and uh, we'll be back uh, with that interview. Neil Schneider, MTBS TV, signing off.